All right, this is Carol Lewis, Dr. Carol Lewis over here at the Medical Office Building. I'll be your mindfulness meditation leader this morning, and we're going to do, um, do the metacognition meditation practice, awareness practice that we did last week as well. Hopefully it will sound a little bit familiar. I would like you to sit in a dignified, upright, and comfortable posture if you'd like, and you're invited to close your eyes if you would want to. Uh, if you don't want to close your eyes, please find a non-moving point, not on another person, to watch. And I will ring my Tibetan bells three times at the beginning and three times at the end. And so we begin. Sitting in a dignified, upright, and comfortable posture. Bring awareness to the breath. To the in-breath and the out-breath. As an anchor for your present moment awareness. You may choose to focus the breath at the nose, or the chest, or the abdomen and as instructed to focus on the breath, bring awareness to that point. And breathing slow, deep, and rhythmically throughout the practice. Breathing in and breathing out. When you find that your mind has wandered, as it will throughout the practice, allow yourself to Bring those wandering thoughts to awareness as best you can. Noticing them without being swept away by them. Then gently letting go of the wandering thoughts. Gently bringing awareness back to the practice. And continuing to breathe slow, deep, and rhythmically. Focusing on the in-breath and the out-breath as an anchor for your present moment awareness. And now when you're ready, take a moment to bring awareness to the contents of your mind noticing whatever you find there. Allowing the thoughts to be as they are. You may notice thoughts of other times and places, things that need to be done later in the day. You may find a focus on sounds inside the room or outside of the room, or perhaps a focus on physical sensation. Allow yourself to see these thoughts or streams of thought as best you can, noticing them without growing them or developing them further, and without being swept away by them. Seeing the thoughts and now gently letting go of them without judging them or struggling with them. Leaving the thoughts to be as they are without need for them to be different. Allowing the thoughts, whatever you found. And now gently redirecting awareness back to the breath. 
the in breath and the out breath. Breath by breath, present moment awareness. And now when you're ready, with intention, bring awareness to your physical body as a whole, allowing your awareness to rest gently on any areas of particular sensation, one at a time. And with each, perhaps noticing how you experience that sensation which may be pleasant or unpleasant or neutral. Noticing the sensation and how you experience it, whatever it is. And now gently letting go of the awareness of that particular sensation as best you can without judging it or struggling with it leaving that sensation to be as it is without need for it to be different and directing awareness on perhaps to another area of particular sensation. Noticing the sensations one at a time with gentle curiosity. You may also scan your body from top of the head to tips of the toes, scanning and noticing areas of particular sensation one at a time, with each gently noticing it and letting it go and directing awareness on to another sensation. Scanning through head, neck and shoulders, through torso and legs, to the tips of the toes, finding whatever you find in the body today and allowing those sensations to be as they are. You might say to yourself, this sensation is already here. It's okay. Let me feel it. And then gently let go of it. Redirecting awareness to the practice or the breath as needed as an anchor to present moment. And now when you're ready, bring awareness to the feet as best you can. Noticing sensations in the bottoms of the feet, each and every toe, including right big toe and left little toe. Now bringing awareness to the tops of the feet and perhaps noticing the feeling of your feet coming in contact with socks and shoes and pressure down to the floor or wherever your feet are resting. Now bringing awareness to the ankles and the lower legs to the knees and the upper legs. Noticing when your mind wanders, that's the nature of the mind. Noticing the wandering thoughts, allowing them without being swept away by them. Then gently redirecting awareness back to the practice as best you can today. bringing awareness now once again 
to the upper legs. And now, bring awareness to the sensations of sitting in the chair. You may notice these sitting in the chair sensations at the upper legs, the hips, the lower back or middle back. Noticing the sitting in the chair sensations now. Allowing them as best you can. And now gently letting go of the focus on the sitting in the chair sensations. And now bringing awareness to the abdomen, to the waist, to the middle back and upper back. Noticing now right shoulder blades and left shoulder blades. Now bringing awareness to the chest and the tops of the shoulders. And when you're ready, bring awareness down both arms through upper arms to elbows, lower arms to hands. Noticing where the palms are resting and perhaps noticing sensations coming in through right palm and left palm. Allowing the sensations to be as they are without need for them to be different. Now noticing each and every fingertip, including right pointer finger and left little finger. Bringing awareness now to the tops of the hands. Perhaps noticing the temperature in the room as the air in the room comes in contact with the skin on your hands or lower arms. And now bringing awareness to lower arms and elbows, upper arms and the tops of the shoulders. Remembering to breathe slow, deep and rhythmically throughout the practice. And now bringing awareness to the neck. Noticing sensations in the back of the neck, sides of the neck, front of the neck and the throat. And now take a moment to bring awareness to your face as a whole. Noticing whatever sensations you may find in the face and allowing them whatever they may be. And now noticing in particular sensations in lower jaw, upper jaw and mouth, nose, cheeks and ears, eyes and the forehead. Now bringing awareness to the top of the head, down the back of the head to the base of the neck. Allowing your body as a whole to be as it is today without need for it to be different. Whatever you found, whether the physical sensations were pleasant or unpleasant, whether they were neutral or uncomfortable, letting them be as they are and now gently letting go of them without judging them or struggling with them, bringing awareness once again back to the breath. 
the in breath and the out breath, breath by breath, present moment awareness. And now when you're ready, bring awareness to your emotions or moods, making space and allowing yourself to bring to awareness whatever emotions you may find within yourself today. Noticing and allowing. You may find one emotion, or you may find more than one. You may find happiness, sadness, anger, fear, frustration, contentment, joy, or another emotion. And now, bringing the awareness to one emotion in particular, whatever it may be, whatever you found, Notice how you experience that emotion, which may be pleasant or unpleasant or neutral. Noticing the emotion and perhaps noticing in particular if you find resistance or discomfort with the emotion you may breathe into the emotion and breathe out from it, softening and allowing it to be as it is. And as with the body sensations, you may think to yourself, it's okay, whatever this emotion is. It's already here. Let me feel it. It's okay, softening and leaning in toward that emotion. And now, gently letting go of that emotion as best you can without judging it or struggling with it. Leaving that emotion to be as it is without need for it to be different. And now perhaps bringing awareness on to another emotion if you've found another, allowing and making space for whatever emotions you find within yourself today, noticing and allowing while continuing your slow deep rhythmic breathing. Perhaps noticing the in-breath now and the out-breath as an anchor for your present moment awareness. Breathing in and noticing the breath all the way in. 
and notice the out breath all the way out. And now, when you're ready, bringing awareness in particular, once again, to the contents of your mind, noticing whatever you find there, making space and allowing whatever thoughts or streams of thought to be there. Perhaps noticing now how you experience the thoughts that you find, which may be pleasant or unpleasant or neutral. Noticing the thoughts allowing them and as we've said with body sensations and emotions perhaps saying to yourself no matter what thought you found it's okay whatever it is it's already here let me see this thought Noticing it and then gently letting go of it as best you can. Gently bringing awareness back to the breath, the in breath, and the out breath. Breath by breath present moment, awareness. Continuing to breathe and noticing thoughts as they come into your mind. Allowing and noting, letting go of them and bringing awareness back to the breath. In breath and out breath. As an anchor for your present moment awareness. And while you continue to breathe, we'll listen to a mindfulness poem called The Joins. And this is about kintsugi, which is the Japanese art of mending precious pottery with gold. What's between us often seems flexible as the webbing between forefinger and thumb. Seems flexible, but it's not. What's between us is made of clay. Like any cup on the shelf, it shatters easily. Repair becomes the task. We glue the wounded edges with tentative fingers. Scar tissue is visible history. The cup more precious to us because we saved it. In the art of Kintsugi, a potter repairing a broken cup would sprinkle the resin with powdered gold. Sometimes the joins are so exquisite. They say the potter may have broken the cup 
just so he could mend it. Kintsugi is the Japanese way of honoring and repairing broken ceramic objects with a special lacquer mixed with silver, gold, or platinum. It's an embracing of the flawed or imperfect, honoring it as essential. Japanese kintsugi artists believe that when something suffered damage and has a history, it becomes more beautiful. And continuing to breathe, noticing thoughts, allowing them, yet then letting go of them, bringing awareness back to the breath. If you find that your mind has wandered to physical sensations, notice the sensations in the body and however they are, whatever they may be, allow them then gently let go of them, bringing awareness back to the breath, the in-breath, and the out-breath. available throughout the day as an anchor for your present moment awareness. And when you're ready, in your own time, allow the eyes to open. Sometimes we'll put a hand over the eyes to make this transition more gentle. And I hope you'll all go a little more mindfully through the day. And we will practice again next Thursday.